Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is Pangea Craft, and I'm going to show you basically my trip and how I re got to this location, which is going to be my new base area. I kind of like it. It really has some nice views and nice areas. Now, I did record uh, starting to the clip that I'm about to show you, but the video, I guess the settings I had didn't work properly. I did adjust them halfway through the video, which made it a nice clear video and sound and all that fun stuff. But I did cut a good portion out of what I recorded, pre-recorded. So I'm going to show you that clip and I hope you enjoy. Alrighty, here it goes. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to try to find a base location that we can probably get some supplies at. So let's go ahead and start with getting some trees, at least get started here on Pangea Craft. Seems like a very busy server. There's one, two, three, four, five, including us on the server, which is a cool thing. All right, so there is us getting some supplies. Perfect. We might have to kill this guy, though. All right, we're collecting some wood, and we're going to go into <gasps> floating tree. We are going to go into the wilderness over here and try to find a location that we can temporarily call a base. Now, I don't know if they have any data packs or any of that fun stuff installed here. Guess that's quite new to me. We don't know. But I guess we'll find out as we go. There's some sugar cane, so let's go ahead and grab that sugar cane over here. Ouch. We're probably going to have to take and find a temporary location, something to call home. Something that, uh, you know, we can put down some roots, another floating tree. Something like that. I think we really have to work on some stone tools, and I think this might be a perfect place to get started with that. Because this is right out in the open. We can basically get our stone set of tools and things like that to get started. Now, I'm going to go for 20, because I think 20 is all we really need here. To get what we need started. And I'm looking pretty hungry. And I don't see. Many options for food. I do have two raw beef. So it is possible that we may have to cook that real quick. And eat it so we can get some power and sa safety back here. All right, that's what we're going to do, I think. And while that's doing that, I think we'll grab a little bit of wood. I do see berries, so we're probably going to also go get those berries just to be safe here. Just to be a little bit more on the better side. I think two of those will actually give us enough food. And let's go ahead. And stone up here real quick. We're going to get douche, dish, a cheval, and the axe. Beautiful. All right, let, let's um collect some of these berries actually too. 
might be our food for a while and we don't want to be completely foodless. I do see a what is that? Piggy. Well, if we get a couple of those, we probably can go down and start mining and grabbing some supplies. Hello, Foxy. Does look like someone's got something going on here. Oh, this is a village. That doesn't look like it's been found. But whatever we grab, we will replant. Because... This could honestly be someone's farm and we don't know for sure. We're just grabbing a few items and we'll probably grab one of these beds. And that thing since it's, it's easy to craft, but I don't have one. It actually looks like this place maybe have been untouched. It doesn't look like they have one person sleep. Oh, okay, so they do. I am stealing your bed. Thank you, buddy. That's really awesome. You can keep your bell. And since it doesn't look like it was touched or viewed by anybody, I think I'm going to check a few of these places out up here. Just to see. If there's anything useful in these, it looks like some food, some wood. Potatoes are very good to have. And you have more potatoes, bread, and a pie. Is there another place over here? There is. He's the one hanging out at the top of the hill. Doesn't look like anything I could use. So I'm not going to take it. Alright, well that was a pretty good raid myself. On something that apparently no one has been at, so. That is pretty cool. So, I've been here. Oh, no, I haven't been here. I want that. Oh, another one of those, but that can stay, because I only need one. Potatoes. Definitely going to have a potato farm. Very cool. Very cool. I see an opening over there somewhere, so I think we're going to go follow the trail and see if we can find that again. Now, I don't know if I've been down here or not, actually. It looks like this is the farm I started at. Hmm. Now, where did I see that trail? I see an opening to, uh, open area. I figured that may be a good place to actually start my living quarters and things like that. But now I can't seem to find it. I could actually live in this wooded area. That'd be kind of cool. I do like my spruce. But I don't know if that's where I want to be. Don't know if that is where I want to be. Let's see. You know what? The overlook over here is pretty nice, actually. Right here. Right here. Oh, it looks like someone's got something being built over there, though. I don't want to intrude on somebody's builds. Because I am planning on building pretty big in this area. 
or in my area, not particularly this area. And I don't want to intrude in somebody's to somebody else's area. That'd be kind of rude. I mean, obviously they've been there first, so let's not be jerks. We have a couple of that right now. We'll probably need torches and things like that at one point. Eat a couple of these berries. Now, oh, this really isn't a bad place, though. Ooh, that's even better. Let's go see if anybody claimed the top of that hill. Ooh, lava, lava, lava. Mr. Lava, lava. Ooh, Mr. Lava, lava. Ah, 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 ah. Mr. Lava, lava. Ooh. Alright, I think we're going to go ahead and claim this area. What we're going to do with it, I have no idea. But I kind of like it. You got that lake right there. We're going to grab that sugar cane right there. We got the lake. And we got this up here. We have a plateau kind of area here so we got snow up there which is good for us uh ice whatever farm uh ice farm and i think this is really nice we got the views over there i think this is where we're gonna be so let's lay down our purple bed our furnace uh crafting table one of these but i wanted that right next to the crafting table because that's where that's important this is not that important right now but we're still gonna put it there we'll throw torch on both of those grab this and go boop 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 and this is where we live right now and i think we should make it clear that we live there by putting this and right in X techno place. It's hard to read on this sign, but I think people will get the idea. Maybe. All right, so that is the plan. We have a location that looks like. A one of the Brucies, and then we have that and then we have oak down there so we can definitely make a few tree farms up here for different kind of trees needed and wanted which is definitely a plus but i think that is probably going to be the starting ending area of this video I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe, share this video, and keep your eyes open for more Pangea craft. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye bye.